pretty much uh this my channel uh, i don't have one specific thing i talk about i'm just gonna say that i talk about anything that piques my interest so that goes from food all the way to anime and then you'll see some hip-hop battle rap all in between that shit and maybe it may be some little infographic thing I didn't see, but today I'm, I'm talking about uh, chapter 37 and episode 121 of Boruto Uzumaki. Ah, oh, man. So, those who know, don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the manga and the actual anime. Ah, oh, man, this shit is wild. I don't know who this Kashi and Koji is, but more importantly, I don't know who this Jigen is, but they, but according to this Caution Koji, Jigen was like, uh, according to Caution Koji, uh, Jigen can kill Naruto, and the only way to stop that man is through the markings of Kawaki and Boruto. I'm like, that's the only way you can stop that man. And it's wildness, because now I'm looking at it like, uh, he didn't really give Kawaki a whole. A whole fucking like he gave him a whole curse mark, and that and it's funny like like his process was just like uh, Yamato's when Orochimaru was uh, trying to find out his next wood style specimen. Like it's crazy as hell. I mean that they want to say uh, Kawaki's something like Naruto. I mean in a sense, yeah. But I think Kawaki's a lot more like Yamato, in my opinion, because you gotta think, they went through the same process, like, same, I ain't gonna say the same amount of people, but it took a, a mass genocide of people before there was a survivor of their experiment. And it just so happens, they survived their experiments, and now they are, quote unquote, the vessel, as we think. Now, I'm looking at it, it seems, uh... What's that man, Momo, Momochiki, Momochiki, uh, Atsusuki, like, he really refers to Boruto as the vessel, and this is crazy, cause it's just like, yo, 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 I'm gonna have to make some little shits before this to, like, get to where I'm talking to now, now I'm talking this shit, I mean, that's just all in the manga, that's all in the manga, right now in the, uh, right now in the show, I left off on, uh, Boruto, you know, man, he, he being the big rebel. He been, he been a big rebel. And he skipped out on his grandpa's little camping trip just to go train with Sasuke. But he's he all up in, uh, what is it? Like, Land of Thunder, Land of Thunder. One, I, I believe he's in the Land of Thunder. And I uh, see Sasuke getting chewed up by the Atsusuki, man. He, he took a like he took a little fishing rod to the chest, and he like, get Give me that chakra, bitch. And then, like, yeah, that's what happened to Sasuke. And then he got, uh, he got thrown into another time frame by that nice ass piece of Renegon that that Atsusuki carried. And the shit was crazy. The shit was crazy. And I'm just sitting here like a fiend waiting for the next episode. But at, in the meantime, in between time, I'm watching that little Rock Lee spinoff. That's how we do it in these streets. But, hey, this is just my little review about just a few things I've seen. But I'm not trying to see Naruto die. And I'm trying to see, uh, I'm trying to see Boruto see what that curse mark gone for. Hitting for. But this is just my little recap of what I've seen so far on Boruto. Enjoy.